Confessions of a Dollar Tree Addict. I'm Marina and we have a Dollar Tree haul and it is a Dollar Tree haul that is in the car with the AC blasting in the parking lot of the Floral Park Dollar Tree. So this is something I have never done before. Usually I'll pull over like at the beach or something. I'm not allowing myself to go into the Dollar Tree until I do a Dollar Tree haul because I just have a lot of stuff that I have not hauled yet and shame on Marina. But um, I do feel kind of like one of those hair ads with the exception that, okay, so this is what happened today. This is like actually true. I have a coffee stain on my shirt, big time. Tried to clean it off, have not been able to since when does that happen? Chris and I went to my um, gym because I'm trying to convince him to join the gym with me since he hasn't been feeling well. For so long but he's starting to feel better finally and we went out to like a mother and son breakfast after we went swimming today and I put this stuff in my hair now normally I use Halloween I use Halloween red year-round for my root spray but I ran out of the Halloween stuff which by the way never does this it's so good if you're a redhead you want to really stock up on the Halloween spray because this time I bought clear all red you guys, when you run your fingers through your hair, when you spray the Clairol root spray into your hair, it makes your fingers red. <laughs> Everything you touch turns red. Look, if I touch my forehead, you guys see that? I gave myself like a bindi just now. This is ridiculous. Did you guys know that it does that? I mean, I have not ever, I always used the Halloween one my whole life. Uh, and I'm going back to the Halloween one because this whole day has been, I feel like I'm turning into a strawberry. It's like in vogue and I'm becoming red or like I belong in Willy Wonka's factory. But either way, this is the kind of day that I've had where I'm turning all shades of red. I'm hot in the parking lot. So yeah, so today my Dollar Tree haul is with a stained shirt, stained forehead, stained fingers, and I sliced my finger open this morning getting the package of the root spray open. So it's just been one of those days, but I'm just gonna start grabbing and hauling. And um, you guys can pretend that I'm in the breeze of a tropical island with the view of the Dollar Tree behind me. I picked up one of these t-shirts and it's t-shirt time at the Dollar Tree. This is kind of a high neckline, you guys know, but I'm gonna cut the collar as usual. I love this kind of pink. It's like that hot pink. Fruit of a Loom, it is self-spun 3X for $1.25, cannot be beat. Absolutely cannot beat that without a doubt. Even if I sleep in it, it's worth a buck and a quarter. Oh, I remember now, I have so many things in the car that I've just been all over the place lately. Have you guys ever seen bold ginger ale? The color is even bold, it's like a darker, I hope it's super gingerlicious because I kind of love ginger ale. Ginger ale is one of my favorite sodas, actually. You can put real fruit in it. It tastes really good if you have a little bit of an upset stomach. So, I mean, a two liter bold ginger ale for a buck and a quarter. I was like, I've never had that. I need to know what a bold ginger ale tastes like. So I grabbed that. Then, can we talk about these cute waggles that I'm in love with? First of all, there are six of them, and I was so silly. You guys all told me the deal with them. I knew there was something, but I couldn't figure out what it was with the sheep one. The sheep one's name is Loving You. Loving You. That's what it reminds me of now. That song is easy because you're beautiful. Do you see that? La, 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 la. And it's like la, 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 la on the clouds. And it's a sheep, and it has happy stickers. And it says, I love you. Oh, well, the thing is that E-W-E -E means sheep. And I knew there was something there, but my brain just wasn't catching it. At the day that I did this walkthrough, I was in the West Babylon Dollar Tree bright and early, like at 8 a.m. So yeah, and even the cashier, she was like, what's up with these names? I was like, Whiskeroff, they sound German, right? Lebanu and Whisker Whiskeroff, but Whiskeroff is, you know what? 
Duh, Whisker Up is not an owl. He's a hamster. Do hamsters have whiskers? All right, I don't think I've still quite grasped the whole collection yet, but let me show them to you. I bought them for my nieces. I kind of wish that I could buy these. No. Whisker off. Oh, wise. Wait a minute. He's definitely an owl. Look, those are bird feet. But his name, I guess they kind of want to say wise, but they made WH because owls are wise, obviously. But I mean, either way, he's so cool with his glasses. So we have wise Garof and Lovinu, which is the sheep. And they come with accessories and stickers. And we have the hippo, which is good and fed. That one's simple, good and fed. Still, they kind of seem like German names to me. And there's an ice cream cone. And is that, oh, it's like a little chef hat that you stick in the hole in, its in his head or her head, we don't know. And some French fries, because she's chowing down. She's a hungry, hungry hippo. Then we have Smile and Oink, and he's like, he's got a be kind. So he is surfing the clouds, uh, Smile and Oink, and he's got like a life preserver or a belt that says be kind. I thought it was a life preserver, but he's surfing on a scape. Like he's surfing in the clouds in the picture. So I don't really know exactly what their whole theory on this life preserver is, but that's what he's got. He's got a belt or a band that says be kind in the center, which I think is really funny. And he also has a hole in his head for his little cat. So he definitely needs that because he's got a hole in his head and they come with little sunglasses and they come with little stickers. For $1.25, I definitely think that these are worth the money. Then we have the donkey whose name is Huffenschmies. Huffenschmies is a donkey whose tail actually is posable. And, oh, they're posable, by the way. They, you can move their parts. And he's actually surfing. Like, he's an actual surfer. So he's got a real surfboard and his life preserver and stickers as well. And then, okay, so that's six. But then they brought us a bunch of accessories. Oh no, that's three, four, five. Hmm, one more to go. Oh yes. Oh, this is my favorite one actually. The penguin, his name is Colden Schlepp. I love it. Absolutely love his name, it's funny. Isn't Colden Schlepp cool? He has a boogie board. He's got a Waggles boogie board and some snow goggles and a chill beanie. He's my favorite. I love, peng I actually love penguins. I think they are so, so cute. Another t-shirt, and I really like this one. It's also a 3X, but I just love the super v-neck that it has. I wore another one the other day that was like blue with a tipping on it that I actually bought for Chris, and then I realized Marina, you're not in the 70s. Your son is not wearing a huge V-neck. He's not in Three's company. He's not gonna want, Chris was like, mom, I'm not wearing that. And I was like, oh, okay, I just really love the color. He was like, I love the tipping on the sleeve, but I don't want a V-neck like that. That's too much of a V-neck. But then I've been finding these 707, I think it's just too bright, these 707 adult size 3X t-shirts and when I find them, I love them. These actually do shrink when you wash them. They're like a really nice fabric, so get them a little bigger, but I love them. They're super lightweight. Can you guys see like how super lightweight this cotton is? I feel like these are all cotton. Imagine it's like 100% not cotton. Oh my goodness, I called it. This is totally 100% cotton, and it feels scrum delicious. So, I picked up three of these white ones because, I mean, I'm already doing a video with a big old coffee stain. So when I'm sporting these white ones, I'm gonna need backup. I already know, and you already know. That's how it goes. Now, I was lucky enough to grab some of these. The first time that I found them, there was only like one on the shelf, and I got it, and I've been taking them. 
And then I bought another one, but I gave it actually away already. I, I bought two others, but I bought them for my friends because I don't need more than 170 of these. I mean, how many can I possibly take with all the vitamins that we have coming into the Dollar Trees? I kind of love the goalie ones. They're also multivitamins, but they're like a chocolate treat every day. So now this is how big they are. These are tasty. I just want you guys to know that I've never been happier taking vitamins for two of these gummies, which I love gummy candy. They taste so good. It's like buying candy and it has vitamins. I mean, we're all going to get fat. Who are we kidding? But I mean, well, I, oh, mm, mm, mm. I never had a raspberry one before. Oh, each one is a different flavor. I thought, wow, these are so good, you guys. And they do come sealed. But like I said, I, I want to take another one right now. I did not know that. Oh, wow. Now I have to pay attention every day to which two flavors I try because they're delicious. So you have to try not to OD yourself on vitamins. The suggested um, vitamin dosage is take two gummies daily. I, I don't know if people are able to do it, but these are so good. Grab them if you see them. I mean, you know what? It can't hurt. It's a multivitamin. It's still better than taking actual gummy candy. In my opinion, I feel like that's the, the worst that it could do is, what's the worst it could do? It's better than eating sour candy. Okay, these do not buy them. They are totally disgusting. Now, I picked up two packs of these and I brought them to Connecticut when I went to visit my aunt recently and we opened one pack. They're gross, you guys. I, there's nothing more I can say other than that they're gross. I, you know what? I don't even want to open this pack. That's how gross they are. Maybe I'll exchange them here if they let me. Because I think they're spoiled. They must be very, very old. They're by the brand Adore. They're supposed to smell like mango and all different fragrances. You guys see that? There's four different ones in here. But the truth is, what they smell like is dirty, dirty socks. They smell, these just smell dirty. Oh, like, yeah, there's like a strawberry. One of them is raspberry. One of them is mango, grape. And the other one was melon. I, they are not good. Let me know in the comments down below if you opened yours and if it didn't stink because like I said, the pack that I opened smelled so bad, I don't, I'm not even opening this one because I, I'm going to exchange it. Then I found these, you guys. When, when I was on Staten Island, I found these. Hair food, hair skin and nail vitamins, fermented biotin, and superfood herbs. I was so excited when I found these. They're non-GMO. Everything about them is fabulous. These go for definitely more than a buck and a quarter. I think they go for 11 bucks. And I did see three in the Staten Island store, but I was like, you know what? I'll find them again. Let me just buy one. And then I've never seen them again. And I'm so devastated because I think this is like my absolute favorite, favorite thing that I've seen by the brand Hair Food so far because I love taking biotin. I mean, I dye my hair a lot. That's not good for your hair. I'm getting older. I have a lot of gray hair. So taking a good non-GMO biotin for hair, nails, and skin that's always something that I think is definitely worth it. And look, the bottle is amber. It's a glass amber bottle. These are good, you guys. If I ever see these again, I'm scooping up two more because they don't expire until December. So that's a great buy. I wish I, wish I had bought all three, but I didn't. I really thought I would find more. And I'm glad if somebody else got to try it, I'm happy for them because I, I can always order them on Amazon if I don't see them again, but I hope I get to find them for $1.25. Then we have See You at the Beach. I love it. There were a bunch of different new flower sack towels, but I have so many of the amazing stitch and weft that they gave us this year, but I bought this one because I'm going to put it in my bathroom. I just like to hang a cute towel on the knob of the mirror over like a 
a nautical hook that I have and we all know not to use it it's really just for guests so so yeah that's perfect see you at the beach and I love the little houses they remind me of the beach fairy garden stuff that they've given us lately so and last year and the year before I think it's been three three years but I love that stuff and I bought all those little beach huts so I'm gonna put them in the bathroom and it's gonna be super cute then I found this I think I found it here actually the last time I was here in Floral Park and I've had these before and these are really really cool it says to use these dry they are four miracle blotting cushions smooth and perfect use with cushion compacts so that's very cool for a dollar 25 by real techniques absolutely I was happy happy to find that I thought maybe they were bringing them back but I've seen hide nor hair of them so those must have been some kind of inventory gem from what I can gather then I think I don't even know if I shared the other one yet I have found I think three of these scribble sticks so far one was caramel one was marvelous and then there was one other one I think ginger something was my favorite one but it's probably in the back seat of this car so this is caramel and a scribble stick is basically it says put it on your eyes and lips wonder if I'm screaming okay now I can talk a little lower I turn the AC down now because now I'm chilly you know how we are first we're hot then we're cold it is what it is I love it hot though I don't care then um so I'm gonna test this one out maybe if I could get it open the flower beauty stuff is always very very well sealed up and I love that it comes in the mylar bag which you don't have to rip it open you guys you could just open it and just in case you guys didn't know you don't have to rip these open you can just open them they're ziploc bags and they ziploc right so and then they come sealed I just peeled the safety seal off and it says for eyes and lips let's take a look at this because I love retractable we love that yes drew yes I oh that's pretty hmm I think I would wear that in the fall and then as an eyeshadow I'm just scribbling 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 and then smudging let's see um well you know maybe if I actually tried to do it nice but I like the texture of it it's really creamy it's a really nice it actually would be good eyeshadow if I could actually see what I was doing but you could also probably do like a fine line if you really wanted to because it has like a point I, th I think this is a pretty cool product it has a very nice texture no stinky smell that's a great buy at a dollar 25 flower beauty is not a dollar 25 anywhere I mean I love when they bring Drew Barrymore into the Dollar Tree absolutely love everything I don't think I've I mean the palettes of course but even this is a really nice lipstick color you could if you don't like it matte I mean it's definitely matte but if you don't like matte you could always put like a lip shine over it but I think for the price it's amazing definitely a great buy I found these in the Dollar Tree the other day and I actually have been meeting to haul them so I can ship out a box that I have for a purple loving friend guess who it's going to oh my gosh I feel like I am such a slacker I've been meaning to mail that box out forever but I'm always like oh I want to find that one more purple thing and then that one more purple thing and then it's taken me forever to get that box out infused with argon oil gold series edge tamer so comment down below if you know what purple lover this is going to I think I picked up two for her um, infused with argon oil like I said edge tamer I wish they had this during the holiday season because this would have been a great donation but I haven't seen it in droves in the stores just like a handful here a handful there um, but it's not it doesn't seem to be like blowing up everywhere so I could buy a ton of them and save them now this 
this is one of the best finds I've found in the Dollar Tree in a long time as far as something that my family actually uses. My son started taking these a few weeks ago, maybe about a month ago, and they really started helping him. He has like a lot of digestive issues ever since he had mono. This is a prebiotic fiber, partially hydrolyzed guar gum is a truly regulating fiber that nourishes good bacteria in your gut to help promote digestive health. And his doctor actually put him on this. And then the next thing you know, it's in the Dollar Tree. So I actually picked up two boxes of these. And if I see them again, I'm gonna pick up two more because these don't expire until February. And I assume he's gonna be taking them indefinitely. So that's an amazing buy at $1.25. It says that it helps relieve occasional constipation and abdominal discomfort without causing diarrhea. That's awesome. And it does. It actually does do that because his doctor literally prescribed that to him. So we have these nails by Kiss called Dancing in the Rain. And they are nude, nude nails. Do you guys see that? Part of the Press On Manicure Color Collection, Dancing in the Rain and 24 nails for $1.25. Can't be beat, guys. It cannot be beat. So I've been picking them up here and there to put into gifts or for friends. I'm not huge on the press-on nails because I am truly a bull in a china shop and it just doesn't work for me. But when I do do them, I just cut them the same length as my nails, which is short. That way they don't go flying off. Then I picked up, I have another one. But I love, I'm going to give this to my nieces. I picked up the other one as well that had the llama. But I love, do you guys see the glitter? They're going to love these. Absolutely love these cute little brushes for $1.25. I mean, that's so fun. What a great buy. Then we have this. And I told you guys that I was going to definitely check it out. It says IV level hydration. I'm so silly. I thought it's it said four level hydration because I thought it was like Roman numerals. And then someone in the comments was like, it doesn't say that Roman numerals four. Although I, I mean, I guess anybody can understand. It says IV level hydration because this says that it will hydrate you um, longer than water. And that drinks like this are used by people in the military. It's more than a beverage. It's a battlefield proven four level hydration I thought it oh see again I'm saying four level no it's IV level hydration that's trusted by soldiers to keep them hydrated longer than water hoist absorbs instantly and replenishes the body immediately to keep you powering through the next objective mission rep or lap now can I tell you guys this tastes good like it doesn't have that weird taste like for sugar-free drinks It has like a really tart, tangy, almost like lemon flavor. It's not sweet, um, but it does have a little bit of cane sugar in it. It's 70 calories, well, 13 grams. It has total carbs, 14 grams. Water, cane sugar. I'm gonna show you guys the nutritional facts, but I actually kind of like it and it is really hydrating. Chris and I shared the orange one the other day and this one is the um, dragon fruit. So, I mean, if you're going hiking or it's going to be really hot out and you're someone who's prone to like fainting or something like that, that is a pretty decent drink. It's got less sugar in it than like a Gatorade or something like that. So I picked up three of each of these and I love them. I am obsessed with oat milk coffee drinks. I just, I think I love oat milk. It's really yummy. Oat milk mocha, 10 fluid ounce by Rise Brewing Company. And it is organic. Totally love it. And usually French vanilla is not my favorite flavor, but I really like this one. I, I like them both. Nitro cold brew coffee, dairy free. Again, 10 fluid ounces. They are organic. $1.25 at the Dollar Tree Rise Brewing Company. Absolutely love these drinks. 
speaking of the waggles, I totally forgot that these adorable little characters have playground. They have the create your own playground swing set, which is very cool. It turns into this and your animals can swing in their little playground. It also has the seesaw or teeter totter or whatever you grew up calling it. But I mean, the hippo and the sheep, there's not going to be a lot of teeter tottering. It's just going to be like teet or totter, but not both. And then we have this one, which is called the, what do you guys call this? Oh, they call it the very merry go round. But I feel like this was called something else when I was little. I guess it is a merry go. No, what was it called? It was called like a whirly something. I can't remember the word for it, but these are all Greenbrier toys, but I think, I think I like this one the best. It's so cute. I mean, kids are going to love it. They're pretty easy to put together and yeah, my nieces are going to love these. Absolutely love them. And I think that that's really cool. Like for under, what was it? Like 1250. So six, seven, eight, nine. So that is like, like under 12 bucks, you can get a whole set and they can play it together. I mean, that's really cheap for like the next barbecue or something. Great, great, great buy. Then I picked up another pack of these ashwagandha. I was concerned that they might make my heart race, but they don't. But a lot of the time, synthetic B12, it does do that sometimes to people. Um, and I find that some do and some don't. So it's really weird. You just got to try it. And if you find yourself jittery, then you know that it's doing the opposite for you. It could be because I have ADHD, but this one here doesn't do that for me. Some of the stuff, what did I get? Something I did ha buy did give me that. Oh, I think it's the Goalie Relax. The Goalie Relax, I think, makes me hyper. And it has that synthetic B12. Mm, I could be wrong. No, the Calm. One of them. One of them gave me the jitters. Oh, no, the box. The Relaxium. That one does not work for me. But um, you know what? I sent it to Constance, and she loves it. So you never know. You never know who it's going to work for. So Emergency Ashwagandha Daily Immune Support Helps Reduce Feelings of Stress. Natural Ashwagandha High Potency Vitamin C for Immune Support Antioxidants and B vitamins in the berry blend. And let me tell you guys, this one, is this the one that I opened? It's not. These are really good. Like, I mean, these are better than gummy bears. These are really delicious. Look at that. Yummy. Absolutely. I look forward to getting stressed out so that I can eat three of these back to back. Like, they're just delicious. So delicious. I have never enjoyed vitamins more. Never, ever in my life. Because I, I never buy these candy vitamins. I always buy just the kind that you swallow. This is like a whole other world of vitamins. I did pick up some more of these. Every time I see them, I pick up like two, two, two. Because I'm hoping that by Christmas, I'll have like 50 of these. Because I go to enough Dollar Trees that I think I will end up having like 50 of them. It, they seem to be everywhere. So, you know, if I go to $25 trees, obviously, and they have them, I'll have 50 by Christmas. And that will be a nice donation. These are really nice because I don't buy, like, I try not to buy them all in a store. But eventually, if they sit in the store for a while, maybe I will buy them all up because people obviously in that store don't want them. Uh, but so far, they're selling pretty quickly. People are snagging those up. I did buy one of these, the Cute Cherry Foot Files. It is not a super aggressive foot file, you guys. It's just super cute. It's basically like sandpaper, not much, but after you get your pedicure, maybe like one or two days later, if you wanna give it a touch up and you don't feel like going to town with the aggressive one, this is good. But then like a week or two later, in between your pedicure, you're gonna need something more aggressive maybe. I do, because I do not wear closed toe shoes all summer. So I have to work very hard to make sure that my feet do not turn into callous ridden horse hooves. But 
you know, that's the reality of it. When you wear flip-flops a lot, that is what happens. Then I picked up these. Are these the ones that I opened and tasted this morning? And I was like, oh my God, these are delicious too. No, I think I put them in the cabinet. These are delicious too. Now these are the Emergency Gummies Immune Support 750 milligrams of vitamin C, enhance energy with B vitamins, natural fruit flavors, strawberry, lemon, and blueberry. 45 gummies, absolutely delicious vitamins. I know that I'm talking about vitamins, but it's just crazy. And I'll show you guys the nutritional information. And again, I do think that this does have, it has synthetic B12. It does also have biotin in it, which makes me happy. Um, so, so far, the emergency synthetic B12 doesn't give me the jitters for whatever reason. And I'm kind of loving that. Um, I don't know if I already shared this with you guys, but I did pick up more than one of these because I found them in several places and every time I found them I picked up two because these are awesome for giveaways these are just awesome it comes with the little okay so I'm going to show you guys what's going on in here it does have the little spatula that you apply it so you don't have to scoop your hands in there and there's two masks in here one is for after hair removal so that your hair doesn't grow back and the other one is a night repairing skin mask the night repairing skin mask is the bomb and when I used to go to the European wax center yeah I think I did haul this already when I used to go to the European wax center this was like 30 plus dollars and you guys see that there's pink and white I'm trying to remember I think the pink one is for after depilatory treatment and the white one is the nighttime mask but I absolutely, absolutely love this product. I cannot believe that the Dollar Tree brought this to us for a dollar twenty-five. I paid thirty bucks plus for this. I mean, I can't stress that enough. Thirty bucks, you could buy twenty-eight other items, and you're still ahead of the game. This, every time you buy this, you're saving money. You're like making money. That's how. This is how I shop in the Dollar Tree. I'll be like, do 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 do. What? that costs $30 in the real world. And then I put two in the cart and I'm like, oh, I just made $58. Ka-ching, ka-ching, ka-ching. So then I could buy $58 worth of stuff and I don't feel bad at all. So at least that's my Dollar Tree logic. I have even more vitamins, you guys. I, yes. So these are the emergency gummies, immune plus with vitamin D, high potency vitamin C, antioxidants to support immune function, natural fruit flavors, super orange, 21 gummies. Again, a steal at $1.25, a total steal. Yes, all day long, yes. And I will take them even after they're expired. So I'll save those for winter time because we need vitamin D and vitamin C in the winter to survive it here in New York. Now this is Enamel Care Wild Peppermint Theory Fluoride Toothpaste. I honestly like to use toothpaste specifically made for sensitive teeth and gums, but I'll probably just give this away because I, I really just wanted to make sure that you guys saw it. I know that some of you do not um, watch walkthroughs. You only watch hauls. It says only real mint, no added artificial flavors, remineralizes enamel, nourishes teeth, made without dyes, parabens, or SLS. But it does not say that it is um, for sensitive teeth and gums. And since it doesn't say that, I'm not going to use it. I'm just going to give it away because I do have super duper sensitive teeth and gums. I don't know why, but I do. And um, those are discontinued in the world. I think they were mostly carried at the store Wild by Nature. And that store has gone out of business. So I think that if you're a reseller, that's a good product to snap up because some people love that and they're not gonna be able to get it anymore. And they can get it from, if you're a reseller, they can get it through you. Now, I just realized, huh, wait a minute, wait a minute. So these Immune Plus Vitamin D are 21 gummies, not that it matters, 
or 45 gummies in the delicious raspberry. Now, this is the one that I'm currently using in my um, cabinet right now, and this one is crazy delicious. So, I mean, it really depends on your own personal flavor choice. Um, so you get seven doses here and you get 15 here for the same $1.25, but you know what? It's all good because I mean, you guys, $1.25, but the raspberry ones are really much better. I'm not going to lie, but my son likes orange more than raspberry. So you just never know. It's all a matter of personal preference. Then I showed you guys in my walkthrough the other day, the trifle container as a little gift basket for the strawberry happiness that they brought us to the Dollar Tree. But then I was like, oh, you should have used the strawberry basket, the fruit basket. I mean, yes, this is so cute with some shred and, and, or you could just put the, um, scrubby at the bottom. I'm already using my scrubby. Honestly, you guys, I bought them and I didn't haul them. I don't haul everything that I buy because I just want to use this stuff sometimes, but that scrubby is really cute. It's really little, but I don't mind. I really, really like it with the strawberry. They have I haven't used the other ones yet, but the strawberry one I did use. I love strawberry everything, but you could put that on the bottom and then put this on the top and then just use a glue dot to hold the back on and then they could use the container. I love, I love all the strawberry stuff. I think it's perfect for hostess gifts. If somebody invites you to their house, just bring them a bunch of cute strawberry stuff. Who is going to get mad at that? Nobody. They'll be like, wow, I love that gift. I don't know what their whole purpose was, but... I love it anyway, and I have actually used the strawberry scented lip gloss. It's nice. It's nice, you guys, and these, these are marvelous. I don't know what more to say. They are highly pigmented. I know that everybody's already swatched them and shown you guys, so I'm not going to do it, but I'm actually, just in case, I don't know, I love them. I don't know if you guys have seen anybody haul them yet, but they're really, really nice. I am quite impressed with the level of pigment that the Be Pure blush has. It's a nice summer blush. It is. It truly is. It's small. You can use it as eyeshadow. It's got such a cute, like, candy strawberry scent that I really like. And look at that color. It's a great, great color. It's a lovely blush. Or, of course, you guys know what Marina's going to do. She's going to do that. You can put it on as eyeshadow. You could use it as an all over everything. Just do your own thing. Okay, I made myself look a little bit like a clown again. You guys know how I do, but I love this blush. I think it's so nice. And I like that it smells like strawberries. I like everything about it. I like the highlighter even more. Um, comment down below if you tried it and you think this is one of the best Be Pure products so far. I truly think this is the best, cutest item that they've come out with in Be Pure so far. And I hope that they do more stuff like this. More fruity, nice, I just, I love it. I think it's a wonderful product. I would love for them to offer it online so that you can get a whole case of that. I would have given those away for Mother's Day. Oh, I would have loved to have given all the strawberry stuff away with a scrubby in, in these. That would have been the perfect Mother's Day cute little gift. So hopefully they do offer them online. And I did um, grab these as well, the matte nail polish. I think that the color is so so nice. I think it's a really very, very nice nail polish. I don't love all the other products by Beauty Intuition. I have, um, I didn't buy the regular lip balm because you have to push it up and you have to use your finger. That is very weird to me. I don't know what that's about, but I don't love that. But the polish is a great, beautiful color and matte is sort of fun for that vibrant. I don't know. I think that polish is going to be cool. That may be my next manicure when I can use nail polish remover again, because I have this horrible cut on my thumb and I'm scared to ever use nail polish remover until it's healed. I found these on one of my road trips 
and I love this scrunchie. I mean, absolutely love it. As soon as my whole scalp is not fluorescent red, <laughs> I can use it to hold my hair up. And it's just such a high quality, really super pretty chiffon scrunchie that I think it's amazing for a dollar twenty-five. Um, it does not have a retail value, but it is by the Scrunchy Collection. Well, Scrunchy is the brand name collection, and it says number one hair accessory brand. But love it, absolutely love it. In one of my recent walkthroughs, I did share with you guys that these Saint Ives cleansing sticks are back. Oh my gosh, was I thrilled! absolutely thrilled to find these again because I love them and this one was my favorite the cactus water and hibiscus is my favorite absolute favorite and oh it smells so so good for a dollar 25 it smells amazing you can use it right in the shower to clean your face it's like kind of like soap on a stick I don't know if you guys have ever tried this but they did have it um years ago they had them in the dollar tree in like three or four different scents and it was like super popular through all kinds of k beauty until then i had never seen anything like that but i was looking to see if it said anything about k beauty because it became popular because of all that k beauty that was super popular but it doesn't say saint ives is not korean beauty though but regardless i love love this product for just a dollar 25 St. Ives, love that. Absolutely love it. So this is the Peach Beauty Intuition. Now, last time around, the lip gloss was good. It was just the lip balm that was weird because, I mean, who wants a lip balm that you have to push manually? I, I've never seen anything so crazy. So let's check this out. I mean, it's so cute. The peach and the crystally package I think the packaging is amazing beauty intuition is not a greenbrier product they have an actual oh my god okay this is nice okay the lip gloss that's it right there so it does have some color to it but as far as the scent goes It's ultra, ultra peachy. It's, oh my God, it's yummy. It says that it's fun, it has a fun silicone topper. So, oh yeah, you can take it off and put it on something else. Um, This is a definite yes. This is a really nice product, you guys. Let me know if you guys got this in your Dollar Trees. I am... Oh, and that's why it has the little hole because even the topper is scented. What? Non-toxic, cruelty-free, shimmer finish, bold and opaque, uh, professional grade formula, sweet peach shimmer gloss. Absolutely that is a thumbs up. You know what? I'm going to love this polish. I can say I should have bought the other thing to see if maybe they corrected themselves. Maybe they didn't make it defective. Let me know if you guys have seen anyone haul it and if the other component to that collection is also a thumbs up. There's also this strawberry scented lip gloss with the cute little like sprinkles of strawberries in it. I mean, oh my gosh, my nieces are going to love this. The strawberry scent is the bomb. I, I totally love it. And I just, I'm not a super lip gloss person, but I know that my nieces are going to absolutely love those. So I'm definitely gifting that. But this, I had already opened the, the one in my house and you know what? I'll open it. I'll give this to my nieces too, even though the color is not, I mean, it's, it's got a color. It's not just clear. This is pretty dark, but they're little girls. It doesn't matter. They're going to eat it all up and it's going to get thrown away in a minute, but they're going to love it for that second. It's small, but it's really, really, really nice. So you see it's very little, but it's, it's great. You guys, the strawberry scent is legit. I'm going to put it here though. So you guys can see that it does have like a bit of color to it. So it's not clear. You see that? So that's the strawberry one. 
and that's the peach one. I just, I, I think for $1.25, you cannot beat the packaging, none of it. It's just absolutely one of the nicest things that Be Pure has come out with ever from Dollar Tree. I am so impressed with the strawberry stuff. Absolutely love it. Now, I did find a bunch, a bunch of L'Oreal lipsticks, and I loved the casing. I love the packaging. Absolutely love the packaging for these fruity um, lip balms, or what I think are lip balms. We're not, it has not yet been confirmed that they're not lipsticks. We have Pitaya Plumping, either lip balm or lipstick, number 106. And now the thing about these is that I was saying, I'm assuming Pitaya means some type of fruit. This one is called Blue Mint Plump, and it is purple, but I love mint. I already picked up a purple one for my purple loving friend, and that's in her box actually, because I found more than one of it. Then I also picked up Lychee Plumping, so it's lychee fruit, I'm assuming flavored, plumping lipstick or lip balm in number 103. And that one is clear. So that one's kind of fabulous. But my favorite, favorite color is the 102 watermelon. So what we're going to do right now is I'm going to tell you guys what I did. Now, I couldn't find a ton of these in the entire collection, but I did get some for friends, but the lychee, I only found one, and I'm gonna put that in my 17K subscriber appreciation gift because lychee sounds delicious, and it's clear, so it will appeal. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm just a catastrophe today. It's clear, or at least I think it's clear, so it will appeal to most amount of people. And I also, um, I'm gonna be putting the 102 Watermelon Plumping Serum because if you guys caught my last walkthrough, then you know I found the most incredible palette ever, and that's gonna be in my 17K subscriber appreciation gift. I really want that to be like a really cool subscriber appreciation gift that kind of gives you everything you need to just do your makeup, and I'm kind of excited that I found that amazing palette. So, yeah, so I'm definitely gonna give you guys the lychee and the watermelon, and then I'm going to give you guys one of the pitaya, which actually means number 106 pitaya. What they told me is that it's dragon fruit. People in the comments said that it means dragon fruit. Okay, so what we're gonna do is, I'm going to open up this 106 pitaya. That's the dragon fruit. And we're gonna see what this is really all about. What's going on here? Are these lipsticks in weird colors or are they lip balms that are scented and flavored and plumping? I mean, my lips are pretty big. I definitely don't need any plumping, but oh my gosh, this packaging is, this packaging is so nice. You could honestly take whatever's in it out and put something else in it. That's, wow, this smells so good. Pattaya smells delicious. Should I do it? Usually things that have plumping in them have like, um, what is it? Not capsaicin. They have a pepper. Oh, it does have a color actually. So the watermelon's probably really nice. It's a nice topper to plump your lips depending on what color lipstick you like to wear. That's pretty crazy cool actually. Are my lips... My lips are kind of tingling, actually. Oh, imagine I'm allergic to it. That would, that would probably happen to me. Oh yeah. It feels like I have hot sauce on my lips. Hmm. So these are gonna make my lips look like I had some sort of a injection. <laughs> but um, I think. Wow, I feel the tingle. Those are definitely tingle -ishes. Now, 
the reason why I opened the Pitaya and I have these here for you guys is because number 465 hashtag trending. Now this was in my, not the last walkthrough, but the one before that when I found these lipsticks on a road trip, but I didn't find the plumping ones. These are so cool. Um, I think this lipstick color is gorgeous. So let's check it out because I definitely love this lipstick color and I probably will use the plumping serum on top of it maybe. I think it'll make a nice effect. Let's see. I'm just just for the heck of it. Definitely they complement each other, but it is very similar. What did I do with Oh my gosh, I have so many things in the car now. What a mess. Everywhere I go, I make a mess, you guys. I just am a disaster in the making. Okay, so the plumping serum lipsticks or lip balms or whatever they are, they have like a gold tube and then the actual lipsticks have a silver tube, but isn't it gorgeous? Gorgeous. But now I feel like this hashtag trending lipstick is trending. It is the night. It's my favorite type of pink lipstick that you could ever want to try by L'Oreal. Not a cheap. Imagine if this one Wow, that has a nice smell. Look at the color. I love that color. Yes, and you could put the plumper as a topper. Now that, that's a look right there. That is a whole vibe, I think. So definitely, I am putting the hashtag trending in my 17K subscriber appreciation gift along with the lychee and the watermelon and the pitaya, definitely putting those in. I think that those are some very, very fantabulous products that we have recently found in the Dollar Tree and I'm so excited to add them. Plus I'm gonna put that amazing 102 color, which I'm not hauling yet, um, eyeshadow palette. And obviously I have a few tricks up my sleeve for you guys, but I'm excited to be able to give those to you I'm gonna give you guys a bunch of eyeshadow brushes and some stuff to clean the brushes. I want you guys to just get the box and even if you're not wearing makeup lately or if you've been depressed since COVID or if things have been going wrong in your life, because I know a lot of you are always commenting, oh, I stopped wearing makeup, but you know, the Dollar Tree's getting a bunch of stuff and I've, well, if you win this 17K subscriber appreciation gift, you and all of your friends will be doing makeup parties because I just want to give someone like a day of beauty in the box. Coming very soon you guys because I'm just putting a whole bunch of stuff together. Obviously if you're going to have 102 colors of eyeshadow you're definitely going to need some blushes. I hold these one of one uh, lip balms and cheek colors already but one of each of these fantastic products will be in the 17k subscriber appreciation gift as well. Now, what I haven't figured out is if all of the components are here as I'm recording this, where it'll pop up right now, or if it will be in my next haul. But it's coming, guys, so make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you comment down below. Let me know what you would love to see in your subscriber appreciation gift, and maybe your, your wish is my command, and I will add it to this um, appreciation gift because you guys have no idea how much you guys have just given me so much love for my community all over again. I love you guys so much. If I could give 17,000 subscriber appreciation gifts away, I swear that I would, but I can't. So I'm going to try to make this one as good as I possibly can because you guys deserve it. And with that, I'm going to be going in the Dollar Tree. I have a huge mess in the car. Don't care. I've, I've waited it out long enough. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to leave the video a thumbs up and a positive comment down below. And if you're going to leave a negative comment, so be it. But I don't like those. And as always, guys, stay safe and stay savvy. Bye-bye.